everyone, it's Sir Francisco here and I'm here to answer some of your questions dito sa aking vlog. Yung mga questions na pinost niyo sa comments. Uh, so I guess it's best na I'm going to make a video about this and address this personally. So ito yung mga sagot ko based on my personal experience but I would still recommend na mag-reach out pa rin kayo doon sa aming um, school coordinator na si Miss Jess or kay Miss Judith doon sa Cap College. I'm going to uh, post the link ng Facebook account ng Miss Jess para makapag-message kayo sa kanya directly for your other questions na baka yung kumasagot. Okay? So, yung first question natin is from Nido Nima. Uh, question niya ang is yung school fees po, ano po yung range? Sa ngayon, uh, school fees nila is 1,000 pesos per unit. That includes the e-books or the printed materials. Pero yung printed materials, if you want to have it, all you have to do is just to let them know at ipapadala na sa bahay ninyo through a courier. Pero babayaran ninyo yung shipping fee. Pwede rin kayong pumunta directly sa cap office ask for the copies of the modules per subject. And those are for free. Kasama na po yan sa babayanan natin. It's 1,000 pesos per unit. So may mga subjects na 3 units, that means one subject is around 3,000 pesos. 5 units naman ang isang subjects, that's 5,000 pesos. So it's very much understandable, right? Pangalawa, pa-shout out naman po, Idol, from Jen. Okay, Jen. <laughs> Hi! Hope you're having a good day! And, uh, tarong naman ni Rose Ann, Good day po! Yung enrollment po ba nila all year round or my specific month or day po? Thank you! Ang enrollment, wala deadline niyan. You can enroll anytime of the year and you can start anytime of the year. Wala po siyang specific month or day. So, all you gotta do again is just to reach out to our school coordinators, kina Ma'am Judy at kay Ma'am Jess, para ma-accommodate nila kayo. From Marily, Hello sir, mag enroll po ako next month. My question po ako, if valid ba yung magiging credentials ko if ever for immigration sa Canada? I think Marily, yung question na yan is a bit in-depth. It's something na wala pa ako kong experience. So, it's best that you're going to ask Miss Jess directly for that. Siguro mas makakatulong siya sa'yo at nabigyan ka niya ng uh, insights kung magiging valid siya. If ever na magagamit mo siya for immigration sa Canada or not. But I think may classmates ako na she enrolled with the intent for immigration sa Canada. Next question is from Jess. Hindi naman pala question. But, uh, it's like a sharing. Kung napapanood ko po ang Ibang graduated na, mas lalo po ako na-inspire na tapusin yung pag-aaral ko. Yung mga time ko kasi nagpinig ko, di ko na kaya. Medyo nahihirapan na ako sa mga subject ko. Di naman po ako ganung katalino. May mga time na tinatamad ako. Ipagpatuloy, pero tuwing dumadaan sa new speed ko, ang mga nagtatapos na, di na ako nagkakaroon ng lakas ng loob. Na ipagpatuloy na lang. Sana makagrad na din po ako tulad ng iba. Hi Jess! Of course, kaya-kaya mo yan. Minsan, you felt discouraged, especially pag mahirap yung mga bagay pa. But all you got to do is just to, to have that commitment and stay motivated para tapusin lang yung mga subjects na gusto mo tapusin. Diba yan? <laughs> uh, si Jay naman. Sir, baka lang ako sana mag-enroll. Okay naman po ba sa Makati ako mag-enroll? Definitely. Pwede kayong pumunta dun sa cap office sa Makati. Hanapin nyo lang din si Miss Jess or Miss Judith para ma-accommodate niya kayo and they will be able to guide you sa enrollment process. At of course, pwede na naman kayong mag-enroll online through back transfers your pay. So, if you have any questions regarding business education sa cap college, feel free to post your comment below and I'll do my best para sagutin yun sa inyo. See you on my next video. Bye-bye.